Hey fellas, it's 265 Chevy here, two car garage. Oh, oh, no, not two car garage. Just one big old ass house. Uh, I just want to give y'all a little thing. Got the crown molding up. You can see that not all the, the gaps are perfect. But it looks pretty good. Got the pieces underneath the window. They're in. On both sides. Got some baseboard in. We got all the electrical outlets in. All been checked. Everything is good. Right. So what's next is go up there, set all the nails, fill all the nail holes, um, caulk, three coats of paint. Same thing on here. Same thing on there. Then another coat on the walls, another coat on the ceiling, and then the painting pretty much would be done. I haven't done anything with the brick. Me and my wife been talking about it. She, she said she's kind of starting to like it. So I don't know if we're going to leave that or not. But, um, and then after the painting's done, today is March 23rd, Wednesday. I work tomorrow. Um, so Friday and Saturday, I'll be uh, fooling with Jeff, trying to get all the painting and all this stuff done. Um, then after that, get the floors done, and then recover the floors with paper again, and then um, get the cabinet guy out here again and uh, let him remeasure and. Uh, order the cabinets and then while that's being done I'll go outside and start working on the side of the house spackling all those nail holes and primer and again and painting two coats of finish of latex on the side and we get that finished and so the little truck's got all leak gotta fix that So it's coming, little by little. And it looks, looks pretty good. You gotta put all the lights in, tested all the lights, everything works. Um, got a dimmer on this switch. You know, got the light dim. Lights. This switch over here dims, dims these lights over there. And the reason why that happens is that I got the wrong bulb in there. So there's a little adjustment on the demo. And this switch over here turns the light on and off. So. I got them on two different circuits because mostly uh, we go in and out those doors, those lights are just pretty much for the table you know, so that's the way my wife wanted it that's where they have it got another switch for the demo that's going to work the, the pendant lights right there so that's about it I'll just get some scuffed up. It's pretty smooth. A lot of dust. Gotta wipe it all down, brush it all off. But um from cutting. But hit it with a scotch bright, just give it a little tooth, put a little flow trawl in the paint. 
Is it Penetrol or Flotrol? I think it's Penetrol. For uh, all base paint. And I'll make it slide out like glass. Um, have a lot of more imperfection. That's about it, fellas. Oh, Tom. Just want to let you know, man, I had a uh, great conversation with you yesterday. It was fun talking to you. It's always a pleasure. But, um, you know, just keep those bills coming. I'm uh, trying to catch up on the on the videos. Oh yeah, and here, man, that was a pain. Had to, um, they had a, um, an outlet that was there. So we had to, um, you know, make a little patch. And I learned some things with that, using a router and cutting, you know, uh, using a jig, making a jig, and then cutting probably like a quarter inch down, and then cutting a, a square out and making that fit into there. Then we had a mill. We had a plane, these baseboards, to a lot. The baseboard that, that came with the house, it's a lot thicker. And um, we had to plane them down so they would fit, give a little reveal on the, uh, on the casing. Because I put, I put, you know, um, half inch sheetrock on the walls. You know, five eighths on the ceiling, but half eight on, half inch on the wall, and it took a lot of reveal up. So, so I mean, only got so much reveal, so I had to thin out those baseboards. So there's a lot more. It don't look like a lot of work, but it is a lot of work to get it. Same thing with these. I had to mill these or plane them. I keep on saying mill. Um. So uh, a little mold and underneath. If I didn't, the little mold and would uh, either stick past the window. So, I don't know. Um, so, hopefully, um, that looks pretty good. After it's painted and everything, it's going to look real good. But I just wanted to give y'all an update, fellas, what's going on. Kitchen's coming along. I don't really hit it hard um, Friday and Saturday. I had those two days off. I've been bringing my mom to the doctor's pretty often. You know, she's got to get some tests done and stuff like that. And, you know, she's got a blocked artery. Um, so, and she's 86, so uh, we're working on that, you know. So there's a lot going on. Just had a, um, um, well, just, well, anyway, just a lot going on. <laughs> Holidays coming up and everything else like that. All right, fellas. Later.